Hey, what's up everybody? Warboss Tay here, giving you my daily update. Happy Thanksgiving, first of all. I decided to do a little work on my dwarves in between all the turkey and stuffing. And here's my hand weapon shield, guys. Here's three ranks of it. I'm working on the last rank right now, but I decided to stop and get this video out. I'm also doing the um, standard for them right here. And uh, I haven't even started on these guys. And look who who snuck out of the rest of the Thunderer unit. I, I missed him when I was picking my warriors out of the out of the horde back here and then I, I saw his handgun barrel and I was like, ah, I missed one guy for my handgunner unit. So so there's a Thunderer I'm gonna have to paint up. But um, yeah, I'm gonna finish these guys up hopefully later tonight or tomorrow. Got a, the rest of the four day weekend to, to, to hopefully finish these guys off. And these guys as well. Like I said, these are just the base coats. I'm going to be giving them a wash as soon as I finish the last rank and the characters for the unit. And um, I, I like the green and the gold for the for the shields. And I also added in that these guys are going to be separated from the rest of the army by their yellow spot colors. So some of these guys have yellow shields. Some of them have yellow banding on their armor. Um, just a lot, a lot of different places for you to put yellow accents like here on this guy the edge of his helmet or not the edge but like the little helmet flaps as you can see there um, I'm also doing grays for the sleeves or grays for the lining as well so yeah having a lot of fun with these guys still taking some time to get them done just the base coats are you know the longest the base coats are really what take the longest because you have to pick out all the areas with color and apply them all one by one but I'm I'm glad that I'm almost done with them hopefully I'll be finished with them by the end of tonight or tomorrow and then I can get started on the next unit also any of the guys with capes I'm giving yellow capes and uh, that should help them stand out as well and also I'm gonna start adding some black hair guys into my units by put basing them in chaos black and then doing maybe some gray highlights and stuff. Put them back to the front there. Just to give a little bit of differentiation because I know I don't have too many. I might have like one or two gray hair guys in the other units, but I'm gonna do like a lot of black hair for them. And um, also gotta do the, the gingers and the blondes. Hopefully the blondes won't disappear too much into the rest of the yellow motifs, but uh, we'll see how it goes. So thanks for watching, thanks for tuning in and checking today's daily update. Hope you guys all had a happy Thanksgiving. Also check out my Tomarcon unbooking if you haven't seen that yet. I've also got some other stuff like the new vampire counts. It's not new, but the White King from Forge World with the army battle standard. I'm going to be reviewing him. That just came in the mail with my Tomarcon. So hope you guys liked it and enjoyed it and hope you're having a happy Thanksgiving. And we'll see you in the next video.